We're here with Yuri Vesely, and we're going to talk about your experiences nearly four years ago in the summer of 2010 at the Youth Olympic Games. Uh, what do you remember of those times? Well, uh, uh, that's been a you know a junior's time. Uh, it's been great times for me. Uh, you know, the Youth Olympic Games. It's always uh, very very exciting. You know, to represent your Olympic country or your uh, your country. For me, it's been a it's been a very good year. That year, uh, I jumped to the third place in the in the junior's ranking, and uh, it was a very special feeling for me to be a part of the youth to the of the first Youth Olympic Games. And what was the best thing that happened to you at, uh, in Singapore? Uh, it's been, uh, of course, uh, a good tournament for me, especially uh, the doubles, you know, uh, when we won with Oli Golding from the Great Britain, the, the gold medal. It's been a fantastic week for me and, of course, a very big success. Like you said, you uh, won the Olympic gold in doubles with Oliver Golding. Uh, where is that medal? I have my medal in, uh, in my... Uh, in my living room, uh, besides some of the, of the biggest uh, trophies, I got uh, of course uh, the Australian Open trophy, also uh, some Challenger trophies. So it's uh, one of my big, biggest successes in my in my career. Talk a little bit about the time away from the tennis at the uh, Youth Olympic Games. Like there were other athletes from other sports, and I'm, you all lived in the same village. What was that like for you? It's, diff uh, it's uh, definitely something different than you are uh, used to it. You know, uh, you are staying with uh, all the all the sportsmen uh, in one uh, in one village. So you really see each other uh, every day. Uh, you play games together. You know, you go to support each other. So it's uh, really something different than you are really used to. And uh, for me, it was a very great week. I had a chance to, to support many uh, sportsmen, you know, to go to the swimming, uh, to that uh, running, uh, to kickbox, you know, just to uh, see see all the other uh, young men uh, become uh, their dream to uh, true. And uh, for me, it was a very great week, and I'm very happy that I could be a part of that. Have you made any lasting friendships? Anyone you're still in touch with? Uh, not so much, you know. <laughs> there is uh, not so much time, you know, to see each other. But uh, I'm trying to to write with some of the uh, sportsmen. But of course, you know, we all have uh, our own uh, our own careers, so uh, not not at the moment so much. And let me just ask you a couple more questions. They did some other activities away from sports, like education for youth coming up in prof you know to professional sports and everything. Did you partake of any of those? I tried to, but uh, of course uh, it was a very tough week. You know, I was a lot of uh, practicing, uh, playing, of course, matches. You know, tennis uh, matches are every day, so it's not like, uh, let's say, swimming where you have two, three competitions and that's it. So uh, for us, it was a tough week. And right after the Olympic Games, I had to, I had to leave to Canada, uh, to to Canada to play another tournament. So. I really didn't have much time to, to, to spend time with, with the other guys. And if some athlete, junior athlete, was going to the uh, Youth Olympics this summer in China and they asked for you for advice, what would you tell them? Definitely try to enjoy as much as possible, you know, uh, really take the chance to, to spend the time with uh, other athletes. Uh, be really uh, happy that you have the chance to to be part of, uh, of the Olympic Games, you know, it's uh, really something very special. I would say uh, it's a, it's a uh, dream that you really become true and that you can uh, enjoy, you can be part of it. Thanks, Yuri. We appreciate your time. Thank you. Perfect.